Looks like Monty Oh, Bruce he's definitely bouncing it. Oh, my God. Yes, oh, yes. I told you. You can hear the jeers they right now from the crowd. They're booing it Stephen A. Strike. Smith. It was a strike on one hop. I was disgusted with myself, man. It was, it, it, there's no excuse. There's no excuse. It was a choke job. And, yes, indeed, Garrett Cole towing the slab in the boogie down here on a Thursday night. It'll be his 32nd start on the year. Cy Young front runner too, as well, is Garrett Cole. Springer's at 259. Dribble slowly in front of the mound. Roar pet. One away. Well, here is Bichette, Neil one. Swung on, a little pop up in back of first. LeMayu foul territory is there to make the catch. And there are two way. That'd be a 2 2 to the left hand hitting Biggio. He swings them as a strike three. So Garrett has a very easy one, two, three. A good night for Kikuchi, a very good night for Gosman. We'll see if Barrios can keep it going. Here's DJ to lead it off. Swung on line to right field as a base hit. Little inside out swing by LeMayu. So now a man on for Judge. Eight for 22. A 364 average with a couple of home runs in his career against Barrios. And that is strike three called. Threw him a fastball, and obviously Judge sitting on something else. One on, one out, and here's Glaber Torres. 3 2. Has a base hit to right field. Nice piece of hitting by Torres as LeMayu advances to second. Now here's Jake Bowers. He is today's cleanup hitter. Driven deep to right field. The pitch forward's gone. It is gone. See ya. A long home run. 3 0 Yanks. Well, no doubt about that one. Jake Bowers gets a spot start in his 12th home run. Davis Schneider is the leadoff hitter, right hand hitter. The 2 2 cut on him. It's not a breaking ball away. Second strikeout for Garrett. Here's the one two. Hit on the ground a third. Backhanded beautifully by Connor Falefa. The long throw is high. Did he get his foot down? He did. Did LeMayu. And Toronto now will have to think about looking at it. It was a high throw. LeMayu leaped. And I guess he came down on the bag. Now here's Spencer Horowitz. Here's the 2 0. Hit hard on the ground a second. Glaber Torres throws to first to end the inning. Now here's the 1-1. One, one. Swung on a high pop around first. LeMayu called off by Glaber. Glaber makes a catch. One away. The catcher Alejandro Kirk. Snag by Cole. <laughs> like he knew he had it before he was hit, right? Once again, the 2-2. Two, two. A chopper to short. The Volpe throws to first to end the inning. Barrios, after struggling a bit with his command, has sorted things out since that first inning. Now a low strike three call to get Torres. Remember, Aaron Boone got tossed out last night for arguing the strike zone. So two down. Here's Bowers, who hit the home run in the first, and a diving catch made by Biggio out at second. Now here we go to the top of the fourth. George Springer swing and a miss. Little cutter right by Springer. One away here in the fourth. Now well, here is uh, Bo Bichette. One, two. Swing and a miss. Waved at that one. A slider. Two away. Now here is Biggio, left handed with two outs, no one on. Right back to Cole. 12 up, 12 down. Well, here we go to the fifth inning. Garrett Cole has not allowed anyone on base. Here's the 2 2. Struck him out swinging fastball. When he needed it, he poured it right through. That's the fifth strikeout for Garrett. Pitch to Chapman. High fly ball off the bat of Chapman. Floreal is there. Two outs. Now two down. Here's the lefty hitting first baseman, Spencer Horowitz. And the pitch swung on. A fly ball to center. Floreal makes the catch. Well, now we're looking at something. Zeros across, 15 up, 15 down over five innings for Garrett Cole. And the 0-2. Tipped into the glove of work that down goes Murfield with the strikeout. And that's a slower breaking ball. Now one down. Here's Kirk. Lined into right center field. It is a base hit. Knocking it down is Florial. Bowers will get the ball and fire in. And Kirk breaks up the perfect game with one out here in the sixth. Well, now he'll work out of the stretch for the first time tonight as he deals with Kiermeyer. Now the one two struck him out swinging. Strikeout number seven for Garrett. Now two down here is Springer. Hit shortly to Volpe. 
They get Springer. Well, Cole allows his first hit, but through six, he's pitching a shutout. Here's Tim Mesa into the game. Runner at second, two down. The Blue Jays down three to nothing. And Mesa brought in to face a left handed batter in Esteban Florial. And the first pitch he throws is lined into the right field corner. And Florial on his way to second with a double and knocks in Kinder Falefa and makes it four to nothing. Now, Tim Mays has been one of the best in baseball at stranding inherited base runners, but this time Esteban Florial ambushes that first pitch. Bo Bouchette leads off in the seventh. Now here's the one two. Struck him out swinging, so two down. And that'll bring up Davis Schneider. Struck him out swinging fastball. Strikeout number nine for Garrett Cole. Ben Rudfed is leading it off and first pitch swinging line drive shallow center and Kevin Kiermeyer makes a great play. Or Kevin Kiermeyer has such tremendous acceleration and that's always the ball that's the toughest for an outfielder. That ball hit right at you. Up here's Aaron Judge LeMayu off second. But that one right over the heart of the plate and Judge lines it to the fence and left. LeMahieu in to score and it's a double for Judge and it's five to nothing Yankees. Now Glaber Torres who's one for three. And this one lined to right and a diving catch made by Springer. And then look it look how quickly he got back to his feet and made the throw too as Judge wouldn't risk it. That's a terrific play by George Springer. Well again Judge took a couple of steps toward home and once Springer made the catch he had no chance. Here's Jake Bowers who hit the three run home run back in the first here he pops one up for Kevin Biggio and the inning is over. Meanwhile here eighth inning five nothing Yankees Garrett Cole has allowed just one hit tonight. There's a fair ball down the left field line for Matt Chapman all the way into the corner and he's into second base with his thirty ninth double of the season. Spencer Horwitz has grounded out and then lined out to center. And now this one to left center field it is hanging up and will be caught by Cabrera who was a little bit back on his heels and Chapman will aggressively come to third infield is back for the Yankees they'll concede the run to get it out up five to nothing here in the eighth. And that's a wild pitch thrown by Cole to give the Blue Jays their first run of the night. Yeah. Came out of nowhere. Now Garrett Cole ready to go with two outs no one on now Garrett's two two. Grounded to third, Kana Falefa fires the first in time to end the inning. And over 100 pitches and a little tip of the cap to the fans as he comes off the field. LeMahieu one for three with a walk. And this liner to right is caught by George Springer. Boy, the outfield defense has been sterling for the Blue Jays tonight. And that will indeed load him up and bring the tying run to the plate. And Schneider's been called back, and here comes Vladdy. Vladdy has 12 career home runs here at Yankee Stadium. Bounces it to third. And safe at first as the throw pulled LeMahieu off the bag. So a run comes in. It's five to two with two outs. Some of the batter is Matt Chapman. And a ground ball up the middle. The second baseman Torres the flip. And LeMahieu can't scoop it. And the game is still going and it's five to three. And the tying run is now at first and the batter is Spencer Horwitz. And another chopper this one stays fair LeMahieu has it and that will be the ball game. As the Yankees take the final game of the series five to three.